What's going on, everybody? What up, what up? Welcome to Pan Nerdia, A.A. Ron here. And Robert. And uh, we are back to business. Back to business. Yeah, oh. I'll learn. He'll do that to you. Hello, Just auto was... save here. Yeah, right. Just when I was doing my, <clears throat> my cool panoramic of, like, nature, and it's like, wait, auto save first. You're like, oh, Hold on a second, what? What is this? Oh, he's all hung over. I'll keep him ringed in, and you see if you can bring see one. See if you can bring one down. Oh, okay. Clean as you can. Okay. Okay, cool. Well, I'll do that then. And I'll do it as clean as I can. I, th I heard him say clean as I can last time, but, like, for some reason, it just didn't click. Yeah, go for the, like, mid chest. Like, not the headshot. Not the headshot? I think the mid chest one is the, uh, you want to get broadside, like, get a good shot on the like, people outside. Why are there people yelling outside? I know, right? There we go. Game. There's crazy people. There you go. Alright. <laughs> Took him down at three. What's that? Three, uh, three, uh, vital shots. With that gun. Heart, throat, head. Alright. Skin and butcher. Take the horns too. It can all be used. Okay, controller. <laughs> is it the fact that I'm in a cactus? Is that why my controller's freaking out? Yep. You're right. It is. Damn it! Ow! Ow! <laughs> he said slight echo here. Yeah, that's totally what it is. Standing right in a fucking cactus. <laughs> nice. Good job. Stole that Prime on beef. Mount up. Dang. Go check something out. Bison pelt. Look at that sucker. Okay. Look how thick go. that is. Yeah, it's a log there. Where are we Where going? Are we going? I thought I saw some scavenger birds over here. Just wanted to see what. Let's get out and bow for the birds. Bow for the birds. Fucking scavenge some vultures. We're gonna pop a vulture out. He got like shot and left for his dead. His moves like, like a... Why would someone do that? Of course, you got know. skinnier legs. But as he tracks head in this direction, mm. I said we fall. Like, right. It kind of looks, Need yeah, it kind of looks like a quarter ho horse, but it's hard to tell. Did you fools shoot those bison? Those are a certain problem? blow. I said, uh -huh. did you fools shoot those it's bison? It's like August Calm in there. Black, red Probably, bastard, might be. You are. Like, it's still hot. Did you shoot them? But it's. Yes, we did. We shot them dry. bison. We'll shoot you too if you don't get. What business is it of yours? What we do? Damn. It's that business of mine. Good God, you're crazy. I got a family. A family. Don't shoot me. Stand back, Charles. I'll get you some answers. <laughs> oh. What the hell are you doing? Why are you killing those bison and leaving them to rot? Poacher. I don't know what you're talking about. God God damn it, tell us you did. I'm holding down to talk. Oh. Mm. oh, okay. We were paid to kill as many as we could and make it look like it was Indians. Just kill him, Arthur. No, please. Don't well, here he killed another guy. Damn, Arthur. Vicious. No witnesses. Oh. Bye, Clem. Hey, Clem. Clem's like, I hate this guy. <laughs> yeah, Clem is like, so, you're still alive. <laughs> Mr. Morgan. How are you? Indigestible, apparently. Aside from that, very well. How's the project going? This is my third time. Well, this, this guy is right God's though. country, and I am his faithful servant. Although perhaps yeah, not his missions. most talented one. I have been trying to capture the grace. Cool. <laughs> the wild horse. Like here, take my hat. Like yeah, I actually want it. Others can't stand me. Uh, like a little marsh. That is a you silver have his outfit. pinto. He's going around down. murdering <laughs> people. <laughs> his outfit. Near me, of his course. green fucking plaid. Smell my stupidity. 
How about I drive him over? So smooth. Can you be bothered? No beard. Feel like such a blunderer. Sure. Right here. At least this time I doubt I'll get eaten. <laughs> you look you look like a look like a vanilla guy. Is uh, strapped. Okay, girl. Let's look, Plenty. Plenty gotta go get another horse. Let's go. Just a scratch. Water is beautiful out here. Looks like it's. I can't. Hear, I wish I could hear the music. It's always real quiet though. Yeah. Oh, man. Easy there, girl. At least, hey, at least she warned you. She seen it coming. Ah, uh, you good, girl? Let me clean, run down the lane. It's an hour or something. Oh, time to rope us a horse. Oh, hit that first one. Put the horses to the open plans. Good much oh, there. Come on. Oh. Where's the open plans? Oh, Easy. Let's make you all famous. Call it the wave push. Can you push them to the right one? Nice tight pack there, boy. Look at you go. Line them girlies up. You want your likeness taken? Go there. <laughs> hey, they look a little showy, don't they? Damn, dude, you're just killing that. Just... Hey, I remember that horse in the middle was the one on the first Red Dead Redemption that I that I had. Oh, the one with the tan yeah. skin? That's the one. That's the one you want if you're going to rope one. I want me to get that oh, silver-tailed one, though. Look pretty doing it. That black and tan one is the one yeah. that was like the... The best horse in the first in the first one. Oh, that white, the white tail. That's what they want me to get. Yeah. Or maybe he wants to get a picture of that one at least. Really wants. Get up! Go on, Ollie. Now run! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Go on! <laughs> That's it. Oh, nice. Sweet. So he wanted you to herd him through there so you could take pictures of him running through that right. spot. That's cool. Yeah, he was, he's getting he's like the first like nature photographer photographer, you know. Uh, he's like he's like, I'm gonna do a new adventure. He goes, I'm I wanna take pictures of people not smiling. He goes, you know, making fun you of that shit. A genius. No, but I can ride a horse. Well in my world that makes you a genius. You're too kind. <laughs> so how are the uh, photos coming along? Oh, amazing. Here. I have another guy ran into a print of the wolves who smokes before they try to eat us. These cards, there's collector cards and different it's rarities, so you can find those. Fine. And... Well, thank you. Take care, Mr. Mason. You too, sir. Of the wolf. You too. Okay. You can put that in your probably now up in your tent or something. Final checks. That's cool. Don't mind me. I may be at this for some time. Man, they really, they really got into this game. And look at that in detail. Is this the water reflect? Oh, the sun reflecting the water. Dude. I'm seeing the mud under it. Mm -hmm. it's amazing. Oh yeah, and you can't even see a pattern. Right. That's really great. That's a unique piece right there. A little cash. Just stay away from my woman, you son of a bitch! <laughs> <laughs> oh, get him! Dang! Who the hell are you? Ginger with the hands. What the? <laughs> you just double pistol whipped him. Double pistol whip. Yeah, fuck for that the guy. KO. He should have fucking not have fucked the cow. <laughs> There's a doctor. <clears throat> Maybe I can just sell my pelts to the general store guy. Oh yeah, probably. Uh, you gotta loot him. <laughs> I think if I loot him out in the middle of public, yeah, people, will get, people will get me weird. <laughs> Make him look like that, walking around. Um, bandana? Can I give him one? No. Nah. Neckwear? Nah. I don't know what the fuck's going on there. Gloves? What kind of gloves you got? 
Just the black gloves? Yeah. Just because they're weird them. looking on Let's do it. Alright. Weapon equipment? Ah, that's just my holsters. They're fine. You just need a hat. It. Satchels, hats, okay. Hmm. Wanna do that one or? Sure. He, he kind of looks like Australian right now or something. That's what he's feeling. Not that right. Australian people look like something. Why is he barefoot though? <laughs> Why not? He's he's trying something new. He's just like. He's like I want to feel grounded. He's he wants he wants to feel one with the earth. There, just look back his hair. Perfect. Jack, what's going on, Jack? It'd be cool if like what it you wouldn't let to? you run full clip Clean. with your shoes off. Anything fun? Yeah, like you get hurt more and shit. You want to come or it's like me. it'll only let you run like kind of like sure. You're like you're not trying to step too hard. It's about <laughs> it's like, oh, time that you start to earn your cake. Okay. Good. Let's go get your pole then. Oh, you do have a fishing pole, don't you? Oh, I gotta take. I, sure I gotta take John's son fishing. Good. Well, let's go Pretty get sure that's John's son. Go catch us some fish. <laughs> yeah. I feel like you're gonna end up. Can you reel it in a little bit? No, I can just reset that. I guess I can. There you go. Fish on the line. Hmm. Well, seems like he's taking a rest now. I'm gonna try reeling them in nice and steady. Say what, one time, uh, me, my dad, and your dad <laughs> went to, uh, like a fishing, we went on a fishing trip. You got a stick of things, Jack. And, uh, me and my dad are, like, screwing around the whole time, keep changing baits and everything, and, like, we, we would catch a fish here and there. This one's a bluegill. Your dad was like just sitting off by himself, just like bam, bam, him bam. Off. He's, <laughs> he's, taking... really, he's good at fishing, dude. I think what he was doing he's, is he kept staying upstream from us. Oh, did he? He was catching them all for you guys. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Born as hell. Like, watch this shit. But then something happened. You're like, I don't know how he's getting all these. You can fish. get food for days. Because he's like picking them off one lucky. by one. <laughs> but until then, you just. <clears throat> Your dad's a good fisher. Wait. Yeah. Try not He's to actually, worry. You know, there's not a lot of people it's I know fish. personally who, like, truly, truly loves fishing, you know. Mm -hmm. He just doesn't get to go a lot, but when he goes, he just really loves to do it. Got one, Jack. Is he still on? Yep. Reel him in right now. What are you making there? Oh yeah, keep in the middle. Yeah, boy. Blue girl, maybe? A rock bass. That's another roll and a big one. I don't know. It's like I was Try using cheese as bait. <laughs> I can just stick it in the pot. Hey, look at this. And what? This necklace I made. Necklace? Mama. Probably had just like a little kid, what a fine young man! Like and in such complex circumstances. Arthur, isn't it? Arthur Morgan? Who are you? Yes, Arthur Morgan. <laughs> Vanderlyn's <laughs> most trusted. Like, where's your shoes at, Arthur Morgan? You read the files. It's it's typical just, case. Dang, don't worry about Orphan it. street kid Why seduced you look so by like that cowboy? maniac silver tongue and matures into a degenerate murderer. Why is your vest missing? Agent button? Milton. Agent Ross. Pinkerton Detective Agency. Seconded <laughs> to the United States government. Nice to finally meet. We know a lot about you. Yes. Dude, yeah. You're a wanted oh, man, sorry, Mr. Guys, Morgan. Sorry, guys, we can bring us back to the Five thousand dollars for your head alone. Five thousand dollars for me? Can I turn myself in? We want Vanderlyn. Old Dutch. I haven't seen him for months. That's so? Because I heard a guy fitting his description robbed a train belonging <laughs> to Leviticus Cornwall up near Granite Pass. Oh, yeah, Pass. that what you heard? Oh, ain't that a little old-fashioned nowadays? Apparently not. Listen. Oh, the glow this is my offer, Mr. Morgan. 
Bring in Vanderlyn. Like like yeah, the sun my is word. Yeah. Back of the Won't air. swing. Hey, that shit. Well, I ain't gonna swing anyways, Agent Till. Uh, Milton. You see, I haven't done anything wrong. Aside from <coughs> not play the games to your rules. Spare me the philosophy lesson. I've already heard it from Mac Calendar. Mac Calendar? He was Look, pretty shot up into by that the beam time we got to him. So really, it was... Mm -hmm. More of a mercy killing. <clears throat> and the Slow. Sun, sun's slowly going mercy. away. You see that? As they were talking. <clears throat> enjoy being a rich man's toy, dear. I enjoy society, flaws and all. You people well, venerate do, savagery, and you yeah, will die. Like, savagery. Like, like all of you. Now we're all gonna die. Some out. of us sooner than others. Good day, oh, Mr. Morgan. Goodbye. Enjoy your fishing, kid. Yeah, don't make me feed you, you the clam. can. <laughs> Who are they? No one to worry about. No one at all. Come on. Let's pick up your things and get home. Realize how bad of a dad freaking, uh... John? John is Mr. Marston. It's getting late, Jack. Your mother would be worried. These little boys back. making necklaces. I'm pretty sure that that's John's son. I'm pretty sure Abigail was his wife, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's totally... That's dope. You pick him up like all like... Come on, boy. Yeah. Uh, Why did you lie about where Uncle Dutch is? <clears throat> because... Well... You're like, come on, Because those are disagreeing. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. I'm, I'm pickling. And I don't want them to hurt him. What did they mean about Matt? Is he in jail? Maybe that's uh, like one I of Gohan's uh, weaknesses. The world is full of disagreeable men. Piccolo is, is not why can't got like teach him much more. Protect you. He's plateaued with like Piccolo. Them. Piccolo can't teach him. Yeah, how about oh, that yeah, Piccolo doesn't teach him. You still got it, right? Yeah, but he's trained yeah, with Piccolo. Yeah, I got it. Right, but he's plateaued because that's why he hasn't like reached his potential because it he was... hasn't okay. pushed himself. I think. It's a lot of waiting around. He's not gonna go. He doesn't have the urge to push himself. Like, go. Let me go change the hyperbolic time chamber like Vegeta does by himself all the time. Because Vegeta would do it and fucking blow up the whole. He's more human than. Yeah, he's there. Saying, you are. Sorry, How you boys get known? Reason. Great. We <clears throat> had a fish, and I made you this necklace. Ain't that pretty? Ain't I the luckiest? Did you thank Uncle Arthur? No need. We had a good time. What's wrong? Nothing. I just met some folk. I better go speak with Dutch. Hmm. Okay. Hey, you did real fine, kid. And now we have these fish. <laughs> we got a problem. What? At least now, just, like the way he I walks said, and you know, runs, man. makes sense. A <laughs> He's like hurt and he's like, oh, turn. Like running down a hill. It's gonna look exactly what it looked like if you're both here right now. They are employees of the Pinkerton Detective Agency. And they know about the train and they know where he's you followed back here. No, they know where he is. His love interest, you had to go save her brother from this like cult that was like all about like, why didn't you take it? like love and passion. Very funny. So maybe it's starting to rub off on him now. So he's like, you know what? I just want to fucking work, you know? Feel the dirt between my toes, Dutch. We do you got a problem? Just yet. So. Bitch is trying to scare Are you sure this isn't a doing prequel storyline? Yeah, this is a sequel, I'm pretty sure. You we have turned right now. corner. Because Dutch in the first one was older. We oh, it is a prequel. You're right. It's a prequel to the 2010 Red Dead game. And the third entry in the Red Dead series, set in 1899. Damn, I didn't yeah, know. Yeah, I was going to say, because Dutch was, like, a lot older. That makes more sense now, because John, it makes sense that we're, like, not really focusing on John. And I've been sitting here the whole time saying, you know, well, I, I haven't gotten too deep into it. I was so just wondering, you know. Good like, but, and thanks for joining us, guys. We had a blast, as always. Robert, thank you for joining me on this uh, epic little journey jaunt through uh, the wilderness. You're so, welcome, man. I hope you enjoyed it, man. Oh, yeah, absolutely, man. Sweet. And uh, you guys take it easy. Hey, hey run out. Mother out. Brag, brag, brag. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And uh, Clem out. Yeah, bye, Clem.
He's like, oh. Arthur's like, I don't want nothing to do with you. 